in hydrogen and its compounds sorry na in hydrogen and its compounds the preparation of water chemical properties of water and physical properties is completed and next compound is hydrogen peroxide hydrogen peroxide so this is your last compound in hydrogen in compound chapter hydrogen peroxide this hydrogen peroxide general formula is h2o2 h2o2 is called as hydrogen peroxide now so generally the peroxide general formula is o2 minus 2 so now this hydrogen peroxide preparation preparation method preparation method of hydrogen peroxide this hydrogen peroxide is prepared by using barium oxide with octahydrate barium oxide octahydrate is interact with sulfuric acid is interact with sulfuric acid means h2so4 produce barium sulfate plus hydrogen peroxide plus eight moles of water so this is the preparation method of hydrogen peroxide means the barium oxide octahydrate salt is dissolves in water sorry dissolves or interact with sulfuric acid produce hydrogen peroxide and next one this hydrogen peroxide physical properties hydrogen peroxide is a colorless but sometimes it is appears as a pale blue color pale blue color and next one this hydrogen peroxide the 30 percentage of hydrogen peroxide the 30 percentage of hydrogen peroxide is considered as 100 value 100 value of hydrogen peroxide so means the 30 percent hydrogen peroxide is containing 100 percent or 100 percent of value or 100 value or this hydrogen peroxide is a pale blue color and colorless sometimes it is a colorless or it it sometimes it is appears as a pale blue color and next one is structure this hydrogen peroxide is a non planar non planar structure it is it is appears as open book shape open book shape it is available in solid phase and as well as gaseous phase now see here this is the structure of hydrogen peroxide okay this is solid phase this is gaseous phase so hydrogen peroxide is available in solid and gaseous phase so this dihedral angle it angle is 11 degrees 311 degrees its angle is 110 degrees so means the angle is decreases in solid phase whereas in gaseous phase so the hydrogen peroxide is appears as open book shape or non planar structure and next one is chemical properties this hydrogen peroxide is act as 
oxidizing and reducing nature oxidizing and reducing nature means it act as a oxidizing substance and as well as reducing substance example if it is hydrogen peroxide is act as a oxidizing substance in the lead sulfate is reacted with hydrogen peroxide is converted to lead sulfate plus water this is our oxidizing agent and next one is oxidizing agent in basic medium fe plus 2 is reacted with hydrogen peroxide is converted to fe plus 3 plus oh minus or mn plus 2 ion is interact with hydrogen peroxide it is converted to mn plus 4 plus oh minus means this is your oxidizing oxidizing agent in basic medium that is your oxidizing agent in acidic medium that is your first reaction so means hydrogen peroxide is act as a oxidizing agent and reducing agent that is your first chemical property and next one is this hydrogen peroxide is used as a storage cell storage cell hydrogen peroxide is act as a storage cell there is also one chemical property means this hydrogen peroxide is undergoes on strongly heating it produce hydrogen h2o plus oxygen okay so means hydrogen peroxide is undergoes electrolysis process it produces water and oxygen molecule it act as a storage cell means it is ability to store the energy and next one is uses and next two property is uses uses of hydrogen peroxide this hydrogen peroxide is act as a antiseptic agent antiseptic agent or this hydrogen peroxide is act as a disinfectant disinfected agent in various industries especially it act as a bleaching agent bleaching agent in paper industries or pulp industries so in that so means hydrogen peroxide is act as a antiseptic agent for killing of microorganisms and also it is used as a disinfected agent or it is used as a bleaching agent in pulp industries or purification of paper like that and next one this hydrogen peroxide is also used as a green chemistry or one of the source or environmental chemistry so these are the uses of hydrogen peroxide and next one is heavy d heavy water so the heavy water formula is d2o deuterium oxide d2o deuterium oxide so this is our used in nuclear reactor process for moderating purpose this this can be prepared this preparation method is similar to electrolysis of water means in that water that hydrogen the protons are replaced with deuterium now that pre, that process that ion exchange process is takes place like this see here calcium carbide is dissolves in heavy water means d2o it produce calcium hydroxide plus c2d2 and second one this heavy water it dissolves in 
the iv water is dissolved in sulfate it produce d2so4 or cd4 is interact with aluminum carbide al4c3 it produce cd sorry it produce al od taken price al od 4 so these are the heavy water means heavy water can be produced during the electrolysis of water in that ion exchange is exchange of ions are takes place means the proton is exchanging with deuterium because deuterium is the isotope of hydrogen means hydrogen exhibits three types of isotopes hydrogen means protium tritium deuterium so these are the compounds means hydrate hydrate next one is water and next one peroxides hydrogen peroxide so this is your hydrogen and its compounds so means here mainly one is this hydrogen peroxide shape is open book shape this is a structure here bond angle is triple one degrees in it is exists in solid phase and as well as gaseous stage the 30 percent hydrogen peroxide is called as perhydrol or perhydrate this is used as an antiseptic agent, disinfected agent and next one is bleaching agent and last one is green chemistry. It is also used for the green chemistry purpose. So this is your hydrogen peroxide means hydrogen and its compounds. In this chapter we can cover water, hydrate, and hydrogen peroxide these are the substance or these are the compounds in hydrogen and its compounds